are doing. A whole lot of miscellaneous. I thought death had cured me of my appetite. Damn if I can't stop thinking about the smell of tear stew. Awakened a fair few culinary cravings, did. Black pudding, haggis and neeps. Oh, porridge and honey. What about you, brother? Any pre-fimble winter foods you're aching for? Olives. The hell's an olive? Raider. <laughs> a raider encampment. Shall we take care of them, brother? <laughs> Ready to murder some fools? Expecting a bit more of a fight. Rather disappointed. of our past can be inextricable from the present. You have to understand that. Oh, me a second, boys. I wonder if we shouldn't check back on the raven tree. I suppose I'm not sleep anymore. Oh, it's far more confounding that I'm the tired one. I've seen you stay awake for days at a time without so much as a drooping eyelid. Not even a nap. Gods do not nap. Oh, tell that to Thor. Isn't that the spear from Tyr's statue? Wish for peace. Be ready for war. Well, I think that's the last of it. Doubtful we'll find any more interesting bits. I always admired the love Tyr inspired. Where I come from, gods of war are not revered in such a way. <laughs> not all gods of war are the same, brother. No, they are not. <laughs> Ah! 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. In my travels, I heard of a great battle in your homeland. At a place called the Gates of Fire. The Heart Gates. You are there? The Heart Gates. No. Is that regret in your voice? I did regret not dying there for many years. But no longer. Another coal raider camp. Kratos. We should do something about them. Is that a frozen lightning bolt? My fight with Thor ended there. That's where you landed. No wonder there's bits of tear statue all over the lake. <laughs> yeah, it was a bit. Oh, five with four was a bit of a mess. Be so heartless about it. It's not a good angle, I can't fucking... Okay. There's that, there's that, so where's that other one? Oh my... I am a fucking... fucking... fucking! <sighs> oh my god, how far... Okay.
I grow tired of your lack of empathy for your own wars. It's Demos, isn't it, brother? I should not have told you, Demos. You see yourself in these wars, in their fear. Let us keep moving. Look, another coal raider camp. We should do something about them and put your wolves at ease. the one who captured the wolves before you freed them? I do not know. Hmm. Regardless, they should draw some comfort from his death. Okay, that's the raiders dealt with. Under nine and guard a jersey by the coal ring. Huh. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that has more damage, but something about the cyclone always made it puts a, it puts a smile on my face. Still scared. Not of the raiders. Do not. Do not be afraid. You are safe. Good. Good boys. Careless. Good. I hear you. Let's 
control. No idea if it was it was necessary, but resources and experience can only help. Sorry, my on checks so. on. Kratos, tell me of an adversary from your homeland. It will serve us well if I understand more of your battle tactics. Hmm. There was Medusa, queen of the Gorgons. Her gaze turned men to stone. A mirror would turn her own powers against her. <coughs> or you may remove her head, but that is the hard way. Which did you choose? <laughs> the hard way. <laughs> He's had quite a few adversaries. their noses. Come on girls. inventory since we last spoke. This will be of use. circles around anyway. So the norns are here, are they? We need to work our way up this way. Anything I need, I want to check out here and make sure. Nah, I don't think it's this far. Never be too sure, especially with them. Um, Oh, 
up there. There. Can you cut a way through the ice? Oh, are the norms making magical ice walls now? No. I think the water just froze. <laughs> Can we hack our way through ice? <laughs> Should be able to. More of your friends. I didn't tell them to be here. Above your fire! <laughs> I don't know what the Norns did to trick all these raiders into guarding them. Not that they have any idea that's what they're doing. I think I hear one of Odin's ravens up. Yeah. Freya, thank you for your help. I know this was not your focus. The sooner we find your son, the sooner you'll be able to focus. I just hope it works. Just the same. Thank you. A fine sentiment, but right on a bloody note when we're out of the cold, brother. Huh? huh. Brother, this way seems like a way out, not a way in. I concur. The Norns are further up. So, what about... where is... Kratos is afflicted with frost, burn, poison, or bite frost shields. Shield strike for hits will cleanse his status and oh. Oh, There you are.
feel something. It's stronger this time. Over here. I never religion. That's a good sign. Ah, isn't it always the third place you look? Careful, <laughs> <laughs> you're starting to call that every video game, movie, and media, and no, just video games. Always the third place. Three is the magic number. <clears throat> we don't know why. <laughs> is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch in the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly, but assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made on Whitting Guard. Delightful. Okay. Remember, the, remember what she said before. These guys, as I said, these guys don't want to be found. So I'm expecting some Arkham Knight Scarecrow levels of trickery. Put it this way, if I'm not seeing Kratos' dead family soon, <laughs> They're not doing their job properly. Ghost of Sparta, Bane of Olympus, destroyer of fate, cruel strike, bringer of war, weapon of the gods turned against his creatures. He chases a redemption he knows he can never deserve. He cannot. Are we in our own minds yet? He certainly seemed real enough. I hate to tell you, the parts in your mind will be real too. So I'm going to assume that bit about the Ghost of Sparta, that was just for us then. Almost looks familiar, but different, like a confused memory. A rather hostile memory at that. Please, fate should know I will not be deterred. <laughs> they know. Not going to stop them trying, though. Oh. <laughs> 
Aesir. Ah, here we go. Counselor to kings. Merry wanderer of the woods. Robin of the good fellows. Let me guess. I'm a long-winded know-it-all and I cannot change. See? You forgot smartest man alive. <laughs> Certainly clinks like genuine hack silver. <laughs> assume yeah. from this point forward, it's assume nothing. One small consolation to this ordeal. At least we won't have to introduce ourselves. Don't credit your reputation, Mimir. They see the whole lives of any who approach them. <clears throat> okay. Have a phantom. Of course the Nords have a phantom. Of course the Nords have a phantom. I'd like to say so far what they're throwing at us is a little underwhelming, but I don't want to jinx it. This way. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. <laughs> The dark and creepy cabins. There's that itchy sound again. Normally, I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear, but this is positively awesome. Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? Terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. And breaking <laughs> tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. Hey, how very dare you! Babbling! <laughs> Please. 
Yeah. Why did you bring him here? You are not welcome here. Wait! Baldur, come back! Talk to me! Did what you must. Brother the Fiend, let's kill him the end. Come here. Brother, help me! Monster! Atreus! I am coming! Oh Jesus! <laughs> Why didn't you trust your own son? Don't let him take me! Atreus! the test didn't feel much like succeeding i see the door has disappeared or it was never there they toy with us still okay <laughs> what is that uh, a kelpie don't see many of those in these parts she must be theirs will she take us to them i'll ask her nicely easy girl easy that's right. Good. <coughs> Talk about whatever the norms put you through? No. Get on. 
That's a good lass. Lovely creatures, but temperamental by reputation. In my land, they'd keep children away from the lost by telling them a Kelpie would drown them. Of course, Nasty. No Kelpie I know would do such a thing. Unless it was disrespected. It walks on water. Aye. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother? Hmm. There were the hippocamps. They served the sea god. I battled one upon a titan. <laughs> that might not be her favorite subject. Good girl. We're here. Fate's own hideaway. Never doubted we'd make it. <laughs> it's quite a trick to get here. Now let's see if anyone's our kind enough to give us an audience. Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head. Enter the home of the Norns. Tentatively. They have finally reached their destination. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek my, my son! son. <laughs> You know the child is an Asgard. No, you see what all who search for us see. To know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. He resists the urge to grunt. Oh, he fails. You come to us, piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts, as if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak plain. <laughs> you will die, Kratos of Sparta. He's accepted that. The destroyer of fate. There must, must be a way to subvert destiny. destiny. There is no destiny, Puck. Protagonists are speechless. <coughs> they do not understand. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable, merely make us seem prescient. When and my son was born, born shut up! up. <laughs> <laughs> your prophecy said he would die a needless death, and he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did... It was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard, and you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. <laughs> Again, he misses the point. Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in story craft. <coughs> Not leaving. He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was educational. Hmm. 
see how well about unhelpful they are. They at least told us that what's what's to come next. Heimdall vows to plots to kill the plots to kill Atreus, which we know because we've been following him. But and unfortunately, it's given Kratos a drive to save his son, which will put the events of Ragnarok into motion. Let us leave this place. Happily. That's better. I can feel things getting more normal already. Wait. That tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. <laughs> Plot device for later, basically. Brother, what they said about the boy... It will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how? You wouldn't seriously consider killing him, <clears throat> would you? I will do what I must. <clears throat> oh, is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Mimir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. Well, Kratos has already given us a taste of exactly how capable Heimdall is. You can't, we can't touch him. So, the question becomes, how do you feel a guy who knows you can see you coming and see every move you can make? Well, the easy answer, somehow you blind him. Maybe not literally, although if we were talking in the pre previous God of War state, that would be under, under cards. <laughs> Somewhere in the somewhere in the distance, you can hear Poseidon shuddering. <laughs> Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure. We've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. <laughs> Again, it's as the Norn said, focusing too much on the second act and not what comes after. What happens when we kill Heimdall? Kratos, I see something. Yeah, no, look it up. Oh, I think, yeah, we're back where we started. Look, I think we're missing the Norn's message. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya. I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe. The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. 
It is beyond nature. Well played, Norms. <laughs> it's the problem of our fate. Even trying to change it, you make it happen. There is no avoiding it. <clears throat> Treyas goes to Asgard. Kratos is destined to die, and he is. And right now, he's he's so he's aligned to take a kill Heimdall. Kratos is no fool. This is how the game is played. <laughs> any hasty decisions why don't you blow off a little steam i'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to give your mind a little time to process everything i suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake though i'm certainly happy to spend time somewhere other than midgard it's your choice brother hmm. 